the current context of donor fatigue here in the region, organisations are having to look for new ways to find funding for their activities, moving away from a reliance on short-term donations. AMEL in this regard is taking innovative steps um, to move towards long-term, reliable and sustainable funding opportunities. Over the past two years, AMEL has been developing um, a model to sell traditional and cultural soap in Europe. AMEL will then receive donations from these sales um, in order to be able to provide long-term support to vulnerable communities here in Lebanon. Um, we aim to launch the soap product in the end of 2019 and it's estimated in that the years to come we will be able to provide up to 20,000 health consultations for example. In regards to rural development and female empowerment here in Amal, there are a number of projects that are currently ongoing. One of them is the Mena Shop that was opened in 2015 and supports local women and cooperatives in rural areas giving them a forum to sell their products and access the market and regularly supports around 70 families with uh, income generation. In addition to this we have Menhia which is a production line based in Aina Domene. Through this structure women are trained on the production of different goods including handicraft and food production and then also these women are able to sell their products through the Mena shop. We also have the Iblil Saki soap factory which is in the south of Lebanon here, for many years, Amal has been producing organic, natural soap, traditional soap, um, and also selling to the Lebanese market. So far, between Minhia and Ibn al Saki, these activities have trained up to 450 women in the production of different goods.